was. That was my first thought. My dad's a pastor. So um, when I found out I was pregnant, I was like, there's no way. He's worked too hard in his life for me to get pregnant out of wedlock. Um, I have two older sisters. There's five of us. So I have two older sisters. And in my head, I was like, hey, they're both great at whatever they're doing in their life. Um, and I have two younger sisters still looking up to me, even though I'm not really doing much. But now I'm pregnant. There was no way. I was like, I can't keep this baby. But then I came here. And then I met Linda, and she was just so soft-spoken, and she would tell me, everything's okay. Like, she made me feel like I had options, I had choices. It wasn't a set law, a set rule. When my dad first heard about it, he wasn't the happiest man out there. Neither was my mom, because, like, I didn't get to tell my mom. My sister told my mom before I did. But, like, they weren't too thrilled about the way it happened. But as soon as they came around, in, like, a week or so, they came around, and they would do everything for me and make sure I was comfortable. Then I finally had her and it was just, it was great. Like I was like, like everyone was like, like, oh my gosh, I don't even have words. Everyone was just happy. I was glad. To me personally, I know it's not the easiest job being a mother per se, but it's not easier having an abortion. Cause like I've had a lot of friends that had abortions, right? Um, but I see them now and like, I can tell even without them saying a word, when they're around my daughter, you can kind of feel it. Like, you can tell that she kind of wishes maybe it was her daughter. Or, like, even her boyfriend might be there, and he's like, you know, like, why did you go through that? Like, <sighs> More than glad. I'm ecstatic. I'm glad. Like, I'm happy. I'm good.